Well, really anything that can be actuated by a computer is effectively a robot. Um, so you can think of, frankly, Tesla cars are robots on wheels. Um, anything that's connected to the internet is effectively an endpoint actuator for artificial intelligence. Um, so um, you, you've got Boston Dynamics. Obviously, they've been making impressive robots for a while. Um, I think they're, at this point, mo mostly owned by Hyundai. So I, I guess Hyundai is probably going to make um, robots of, uh, that are humanoid and, and, and some rather interesting shapes that I wasn't anticipating, like the one that looks like a, has wheels and looks sort of like a kangaroo on wheels. I'm not sure what that is, but um, <laughs> um, looks a little demented, frankly. But um, but, but there's going to be all sorts of all sorts of robots. Um, you've got the company Dyson in, in the UK, which I think that does some pr pretty impressive things. Um, I, I think the UK will not be behind, actually, on, on that front. Um, UK also has ARM, which is um, really the, the best, one, something, one of the best, perhaps the best, uh, in, in uh, chip design in the world. Um, Tesla uses a lot of, a lot of ARM technology. Um, almost everyone does, actually. So I think the UK is in a, in a strong position. Um, Germany obviously makes a lot of robots, uh, industrial robots. Uh, that, I mean, I, I think generally countries that make um, robots of any kind, even if they seem somewhat conventional, will be will be fine. Um, I <laughs>